we had one or two people saying, but you're giving away what your professional, what you'd be charging people yes. for. Because we have stuff in yes, there of that course. you would pay an, uh, an architect uh, to advise uh, yes, you, know. you know, or someone to give you an overview. And we're like, no, no, if it's out there, it's, it's for the good of all of us. If people know that they should hire an architect, and what's the, why should I hire an architect? Mm -hmm. Why? And it's good for all of us, yeah? It if people is. can understand that, yeah? Otherwise, somebody will have somebody who they know. Yes. Or people who actually tell you, I can buy plans off, yes. off, off, yes. online. On the streets. Yeah. Yes. yes. Hi, welcome back to my channel. If I look puzzled, it's because I took a moment to try and kind of let get to know the ladies before you join into the conversation. And I think I'm going to start with Emma because I can deal. She's a Kenya High girl. She's a Musungari girl. And then you did not do UAN, you did JQA. And then, so tell me, what is the world like for a woman architect mm. in Kenya. Wow. Especially, you know, and I'm yes. looking, I want you to go back 15 years to the first time you present your business card yes. at a cocktail. Yes. What happens exactly? Well, let's even go back to university uh -huh. because, yeah. Yes, I, I know. Mm. There's five in the class. Yes. <laughs> yes. Literally, we were five, but we were the lucky ones mm. that we were five. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, we were in a tech technical school, mm -hmm. so Jake Waters, you know, University yes. of Agriculture and Technology. Uh, technology. Yes. Mm. So probably 10% women in the entire campus. Wow. So quite, and I'd come from, you know, all these uh, convent schools. Le yes. Yes. And here I land in this place and it's a sea of men. Yes. So it took a lot of getting used to, but I think the world, uh, a world, the world has a way of preparing you because because of my university background, then landing in the you know, world of architecture mm -hmm. as a young architect was not as daunting. But I would get on sites and I would know I'm the only female. You and your hard hat. Yes, me uh, yes. and my hard hat. Uh -huh. The only female and get cut calling from the the General, construction yes, work, workers, yes, and yes. like, but I'm an architect. Oh, yes, dude. I'm the one in charge here, mm -hmm. but no. And there'd be a sea of mm -hmm. people and they're all, you know, a bit like, who, like who's she? Why are you here, you know? And wow. I'm not the Mama Pima who's coming mm -hmm. to serve the Gideri at lunchtime. Mm -hmm. So that was something. And I think the in 15 years, it has actually changed. I'm so happy. I, sometimes I want to hug them. Mm -hmm. Construction workers fixing steel, hand oh, yes. packing. The, I there's see it. So yeah. many I now. See it now. So it's I'm not only outside. it's sort of trickled all the way down. Well, down. Started at the top. Mm. There's a, a sudden, but it was it was daunting in a sense. But um, I have to give it to you know places I've been, whether it's been at Architectural Association of Kenya or on the construction side. Save for one or two things. For the most part, mm -hmm. the novelty of it is so appealing to people, okay. even the men. And they're like, oh, oh do tell. They yes. will listen to you mm -hmm. because you're the only female voice in the in, in the room. Mm -hmm. um, so I've found that it has worked in in my favor, uh, as long as you know you 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 you. you you do your work and you do your work well people will generally respect you and 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 i've found it as a very interesting journey in a sense that a lot of the time it's actually the men who have handheld me or pulled me into leadership oh, yes. and said um so to get here yes. it's been both uh, men and women um in a sense yeah okay mm. so 15 years ago it was daunting but we're getting there yeah we're getting there we're getting there <sighs> robin you are Kenyan via where? <laughs> because I'm waiting for the YouTube little comments. Why does she sound American? Yes, yes, yes exactly. Yes. No, I, mm -hmm. I, I actually am from America mm -hmm. and have been in Kenya for 15 years. Uh -huh. And um, I have been here. here? I, I first came here to, um, to work with a children's home in Lower Matasia outside of Gongtown. And so I came here to do organizational development. We had a 15 acres um, where the school is. And so I did the master plan, the redevelopment of that. And so that's what brought me here for the first time 15 then you years stayed. ago. Then I found reasons and excuses to keep my, <laughs> <laughs> like, oh yes, I can do that. I guess I, I would love to do that. And then eventually when my children um, graduated from high school, Nine years ago? Oh, wow. Yeah, uh -huh. I, I finally said, I'm, I'm not going back. Whoa. Yeah. Really? Yeah, finally. So the two of you get together and somehow decide you're going to write a book. But to do a book like this, yeah. you need to talk to people in those particular yeah. segments. Yeah. Finance, yeah. legal, yeah. what, what, what. Yeah. The first time you said we're doing a book on building in Kenya. Mm -hmm. 
Did people tell you, uh, <laughs> or did people say it's time? Yes. Yeah. They what did you get? Yeah, they definitely said it was time. Oh, I wow. Think, yeah, I think they definitely said it was time, and, and people were, um, because the sector is very volatile, the it sector is, is very um, amorphous, if you will, and it's, in a, and it's one of the leading, you can open the paper at any time and find a corruption scandal, a scandal related, related, yes. yeah, to, <laughs> related to this. Uh, yeah, somewhere along yes. there. Yes. And so it's one of those that people are just like, you know, either you don't touch it or you just or go in, with it. Yeah, exactly. You know, yes. and it's one of those. But it's it's one that provides an essential commodity. Yes. It's an essential commodity. So Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. It's, and it's also one that's enshrined in the Constitution, mm -hmm. decent and adequate housing. Mm -hmm. And so for that, um, we believe that this is a, a, a dire contribution mm -hmm. so that people can get in and actually fulfill on that constitutional mm -hmm. right. Um, not, the government cannot do this alone. We nope. see that the government is um, 200,000 in deficit annually of the number of housing units that are necessary. And so we want to people that do decide to get into that, and this is even pre-agenda four. Mm -hmm. um, this is pre-big big agenda mm -hmm. four, if yes, you will. Yes. This has been a need no, for some time. For yes, and so, time. Yeah, yes. this has been a need for some time. And we see that one of the challenges that developers are doing is that there's an oversaturation in one segment of, yes. the, of this. And so we want, this is why we're saying here, when you're making that decision mm -hmm. where to build, make certain that it's a place that has the quantity and the, the demand is going to be there. Yeah, you can't and just stick yeah, it somewhere. Yeah, completely. It just because the people you're socked a second to believe if we build it, they will come. This yes. is not Vegas. <laughs> <laughs> Let's put it up. Yes. Every yes. Kenyan loves to do a mjengo, and yes. I'll go to Kitherian or yes, I don't know where, I know. and I'll put up a block of flat in the middle of, in the middle of Savannah, yeah. and people will come. No, they won't. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So, and you're selling it for I don't know how much money. So, what we're very deliberate about, and we say, it, read this book three times, four times before you even think uh, of, of, of getting of in. Getting in because yes. it's not a small investment, not financially, not emotionally. It is very draining if you if you get in without knowing um, everything that you should. So think about the market. Think about the person that you're you're, you're develop, developing for, for from the very beginning. Yes, and and also to in our advocacy world and the the, the, the thing that ties us together is do it well. Just do it well, you yeah. know. Just leave a nice green patch there. Put a playground in. Mm. Don't put build build beacon to beacon. And where are the children gonna play? You yes. know. So that's also why we wrote the book. Not only it's sort of our personal social responsibility to add to the knowledge base because knowledge mm. is power. If it people is. know, if people knew yes. some of the stuff in here, yes. even the segment called location, 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 yes. that's still a big deal. Yes. It's still a big deal. They'd be more equipped if they have the, the, you know, we had one or two people saying, but you're giving away what your professional, what you'd be charging people yes. for. Because we yes. have stuff in yes, there of that course. you would pay a, uh, an architect to advise uh, yes, you, you know, or someone to give you an overview. And we're like, no, no, if it's out there, it's, it's for the good of all of us. If people know that they should hire an architect, and what's the why should I hire an architect? Mm -mm. Why? And it's good for all of us, yeah? It if people is. can understand that. Yeah? Otherwise, somebody will have somebody who they know. Yes. Or people who actually tell you, I can buy plans off, yeah. off, 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 yes. online. On the streets. Yeah. Yes. 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 Yeah. On well, the streets. <laughs> and and we, we know that um, mostly on the eastern, uh, eastern side of, of the county, these are where a lot of the, our, our developments are, are mm -hmm. collapsing, mm -hmm. if you will, because people are trying to cut these corners. Yes. And so if there's not the bring it into um, regular, regularized um, practices, yes. it, so that's what we're saying bring all of this in into a something that can be regularized and that we know exactly who is who are the people that are accountable for this building if you will but if it's somebody that you know you just like on the back of a napkin drawing and I think do this and turn it this way and you're just like okay who do we hold accountable for this mess when it comes <laughs> chapter five <laughs> applying for planning and yes. building approvals yes. 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 yes and so one of the things is that while we're talking to developers we actually are empowering people to come and hold the counties um, accountable. accountable. Yes. yes. Oh, no, no, no. You're actually supposed to come and inspect us on th yes. at least this on many this, times. Yes. Right, exactly. something people don't so, know. Yeah, so yeah. we want them to be able to... The guys to, of the county, yeah. when they come, it's not to give them chai. Yes. Yes. They're actually supposed to be helping you as yes. a developer. Yes. Because that's... They, they have whole public interest. You know, in, uh, exactly. So, so yes, when the building yeah. comes down, yes. 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 Yeah. So you're actually supposed to be telling in the old days, uh, and I never even caught this, but you'd put, there'd be a nice box at city council, and when you needed to concrete, you'd drop a little card there, and they'd come and they'd check that your concrete is fine. It was for your interest as a developer. Wow. 
over and above your engineer, over and above your contractor, over and above what we call cube tests, and we, we yes, have that in there. Yes, talk about it. Yes, what tests that your engineers need to be doing. Mm -hmm. The county would come and, and be that oversight for you and check that everything is okay. Mm -hmm. But that's now out of the window. That's many times when people see Serikali, mm. they want to duck because mm. it's not for your interest. Yeah, in it's, too it's, it's too painful. It's too painful. But yeah. the one thing that I really need the two of you to talk about is that, and this is important, is that um, I'm very big on, on women and their money and, you know, making the big dollars. And this is yeah. a big dollar segment. Yes, it is. Do women get it? Because I'm, I'm very clear that, you know, sometimes we play small for so long yeah. and we're still talking about economic empowerment. I'm like, get into yeah. mm -hmm. the big dollar spaces. Yeah. Yeah. Do, 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 do the university students get it? High schoolers and yeah. female in this case? Because yeah. I know there's quite a number of players, but they're yeah. always in the shadows. Yeah. What are you going to do with women in the shadows in this business? Yeah. So interesting that you bring that up because Robin and I, um, together with a, a great other, a number of other women, mm -hmm. founded what we call the Women in Real Estate, WIRE, mm -hmm. and own especially for that reason, where we were saying that we need to celebrate women mm -hmm. so that other women can also get in. We need to celebrate women who are developing, and they're yes. there, who've done fantastic yes. uh, projects, yes. and you do find there is a difference mm -hmm. when a woman is developing. The, oh, yes. Yes, yes. It's, certainly it's there. Uh, just the thought, even in terms of people with the children and mm -hmm. is there a space for the children oh, to play? There's, there's, there's so much that... in the kitchen. I'm going to always tell a male development. Our dear friend Shiro with um, Fun Kids loves yes. to talk about how you can t tell the difference between a, a woman working on a project, a development uh, yes. project. And a man. She's like the bathroom, the bathtub. The, it's it's not, I'm not lounging. There's no bathroom. Yes, <laughs> there's you no can't, you can't move. move. No, no, no. I can yeah, always tell. No, yeah, there's yeah. Not a, this is definitely not for me, my candles and everything. Yes, yes it isn't. Or the pavements on the on the side. Who's, run, who's pushing a pram, you know, down those pavements? So you can definitely, you know, tell in those kind of ways. But I, I think, you know, more to um, what Emma is saying about wire. A wire. There's yes. also the other side of that is that we know when the, the, we know that wealth um, gives you an opportunity to support projects that you are passionate about. Yes. And so, listen, we let's not kid about it. This country is run by men that have made a lot of money there in the go. real estate sector, if you mm -hmm. will. And that's just one of the ways that you can do that. But we need women to go in and amass that wealth so that they can come and support women projects, there that we go. can support women candidates that we know that, that are for us and, the, and they want the development of yes. this country. Mm -hmm. We have to be able to grow this, you know, um, the resources mm -hmm. so that we can fund the projects that we need, if you will. Mm -hmm. We know that development is, is international developers are pulling out if they, when they see that Kenya is a, a, a middle, middle income growing, yes. but we have to be able to pick up on those projects. Exactly. Who's going to pick up on those projects? If we if don't. We, yes, exactly. If we don't have the resources to back the kinds of projects that will forward the country in the way that we want it to yes. go. And so that's the flip side of it. It's not just for wealth, wealth amassing by itself. Yes. It's that you then have the resources to push the country in the direction in a particular that we way. And, yeah. and, and money gives you a seat at the yeah, table. That's what I'm saying. Yes, that's, yeah, it does. Exactly, yeah. It does so give that's you what a seat saying. at the yeah. table. So, yes. it, so it's not, let's not shy away from it. No. Let's not see, We've. I think we've put a bad connotation to it because we've kind of seen some people that do have money and mm. are publicly out there in the papers mm. with their money, mm. using it in bad ways. But money can be a wonderful good, oh, if yes. you will. Oh, and yes. so that's why we're saying get in on the high income earning um, avenue news and so that we can put them to good use and also you know i guess it, incidentally i am on the mailing list for why i Yay. don't know why <laughs> but one of the things that i hope that will be articulated more and more and more is that every time women of course have a problem with money and it's a mental space mm. um got a problem wanting it mm. And then when you have it, spending it, yeah. and then talking about yes. it, desiring it, and yes. I'm like, yes. Yes. just go get it. Mm. And, and I can't think of a sector mm. that could actually financially yeah. propel women yes. um, bigger than this. Completely. So I'm hoping even the women who are involved in WIRE yeah. are serious. Yes. Uh, they're absolutely yeah. serious about yeah. what it means yeah. for just sheer economic yes. 
muscle. Exactly. Mm. Show economic It's enough muscle. to talk it about at the end of the day, you know. Mm. Yes. Well, well, f funny enough, we're actually bringing the women entrepreneurs in the sector because oh, there, are nice. there are women professionals, so there yes. are people that are t technical, mm -hmm. but we're also bringing those that are entrepreneurs. So there are several women developers that we're very proud of that are doing wonderful projects, large projects, mm -hmm. at scale projects. Mm -hmm. But how do you, so are we tr try to serve the entrepreneurs in this in our sector to say what are some of your, ch it's been a bumpy, economic roller coaster yeah. mm -hmm. over the last, the last couple of years. years. Many mm -hmm. of these companies have been struggling to fare that because they're small, you know, even though they're doing million, multi-million shilling, mm -hmm. they're still Projects. relatively yes. um, small developers, if you will, small scale developers. So how do they ride this wave, if you will? How do they figure out how to economically um, sustain themselves through these bu bumpy patches so that they can continue to be in the sector and provide what we're talking about? And so those are the, some of the things that, that we're really trying to provide them as entrepreneurs. But then there's also the, the other part in terms of like chamas, our sacos. Mm -hmm. How do we work with them? And that's why with this book, we yes. want to do small workshops with yes. them. We want them to see this as, you know, don't just see this as something that you, that you sh shy away from. No, figure get out into how, it. Yeah, exactly. Figure out how you, you Now are, you have no excuse. No, You've you got a guidebook. No you know? right, exactly. guide so yes. we're saying figure it out, you know, and you can develop yourself and to be one of the formidable developers in this country and especially if you figure out your niche you figure out your yes, your segment you. yeah you know all of those sorts of things it doesn't even all have to be in Nairobi no. you know there are 47 million people that need these these items so it's finding out your niche if you will mm -hmm. pulling together your resources and coming up and, and doing that um, that kind of work that's what we're really interested in and, and passionate that hopefully like that, that people will see that as a resource so Emma what's your favorite part of this book mm -hmm. <laughs> which is the one you were like I cannot wait to get to write that part in fact I'll write that first those are two different questions <laughs> oh really yeah okay favorite part of the favorite book favorite part and the one I couldn't wait to write was uh -huh. about, was okay. about uh, building plan approval really yes that I couldn't wait I was like yeah let's put it down for people Cause yes because guys don't yeah. know building uh, plan yeah. approval apparently yes. nine you know and then <laughs> you get asked a question like yes. Atiyo, ni, ni, ni. yeah it's just something that it is, uh, yeah yeah, uh, yeah. And, and just the whole like interaction sometimes with statutory agencies is yes. so overwhelming for it developers. is yeah like they'd rather even marketing they're happy to do and do the billboards and you know that's fun and 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 profile like that's fun but like really um that was the land buying uh -huh. and that those were things I felt that this we have them if we just wrote those two chapters we've helped people wow like, you know? yeah so that I couldn't wait to to, to, to write to write out and but your have, favorite uh, and we have costs and things yes, for different counties you know yes. so about six counties and saying if you're putting up in Kiambu this is what it might because sometimes it's just you don't know you don't know yeah you they, don't know. they slap you with an invoice you're like oh my god oh, you know what I'm is this even, I, I've not even I don't even and you're being told two million bob yes just to get your approvals yeah so yes. that I couldn't wait I don't know. I don't, it's hard to choose. Like being told to choose one of your babies, but I think <laughs> <laughs> which is your favorite? Yes. Yes. Child. yes. Which is the one mm. you couldn't wait to write? Mm. I I, th I couldn't wait to write. Um, marketing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> the really? marketing. Uh -huh. But I think also the part about what is a developer, uh, and, and actually the decision making Page part. Yes. Actually the decision making part. Yes. I, uh -huh. I I I really like for people to measure three or four times and then cut. I, you know, this thing of just running straight in, I want you to really sit and get the whole um, understanding of what you're about to embark on. Mm -hmm. Even though, you know, that things will come up that you didn't, mm, you um, didn't yeah, know. Exactly. Yes. But at least have your risk, um, yes, your, just assessment. up front, to just, what, what will we do if this happens? Mm -hmm. What will we do if, if this um, perhaps comes up? Yes. What's our strategy for, for this one? It, you know, so just have some kind of really a good sense of what will, we, what will happen when this inevitable challenge does come up like it's elections not, yeah exactly it's not like <laughs> may it happen yes. some of these things mm -hmm. are it, it will happen <laughs> yeah. nice. and are you prepared for that if mm -hmm. you will it's just like if you're going on a trip or a journey you think of all the uh, you know eventualities yes. yes and you make certain that up front you're prepared to weather that well and that's okay yeah. i like that yeah. Mm. Yeah. So, um, the book has been out now for barely a month. Yeah, no, barely. Three weeks. Yeah, three, three weeks. weeks. Yeah. And yeah. 
where is it available? I need to know yes. it is available at textbook center, at yeah. book point, at, yeah. at, at, yeah. at. Yeah. So we're getting it on bookshelves. Mm -hmm. They're finishing um, the getting it on bookshelves, but it's available mm -hmm. online at Rafu Books, mm -hmm. R-A-F-U Books.com. Mm -hmm. right. And they will deliver it to, to wherever you, you are. Wherever you are. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah, wherever you are. I like. I, we love it. <laughs> I like. We yes. love it. And, you know, you can just go online or you can call them Rafu Books.com and they'll deliver it. And so that's been the, the greatest pickup, if you will, mm -hmm. of, of the book sales. Mm. Um, I, I still think it's one of those. It belongs in every bookshelf. Yes. You know, there are people who have books on their bookshelf so that you can realize that they have read. <laughs> this is yeah. one of them. Yeah. Yes, it yeah. just, buy it. Yeah. One day, somebody will say something when they're in your exactly. house yes. and you'll reach for the book and say, actually, yeah. allow me to yeah. refer you to yeah. chapter. Yeah. And that yeah. is it. Yeah. Yeah. And yes. we plan to keep it um, up to date and current as much as Absolutely. possible. By really? Any, yeah, because these, this information is not static. Mm. Um, so Same we, way we said that building and your plan and your feasibility to study, yeah. you have to go back to it every yes. every every so often. Yes. Even yes. this, we will yeah, we we'll update it mm. um, with the trends because you don't know what the trends are going to be. Right. Now there's a whole rave about affordable housing. Yes. In two years, there'll what be elections, be, yes. so certain trends will change. Yeah. And as we continue to gather data on the industry, we just want to continue, you know, curating that mm. and, 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 and producing other editions. And the things that didn't make it to the book, yeah. like... You know, mm -hmm. like a few case studies yeah. <laughs> of yeah. actual projects. Yeah. Of you actual know. projects. And what, yeah. what and, works and the for ones them. that went wrong and the yes. ones that are right. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. So I've always believed my job is to spark. Yeah. And I have introduced you to Emma and Robin. And I know my friends in mainstream media are like, but there's so many things to talk about. I was like, eh, eh, eh. <laughs> my job is to let you know they're available and they look good on camera mm. and they are very knowledgeable. So you find them for the rest of the questions you have around this industry. Awesome. Yes, yeah. and the best part is the first ever yeah. <laughs> book <laughs> of construction <laughs> was written by two amazing women. <laughs> I mean, everybody must be sitting there saying, why did we all do this before? Yeah. Completely. <laughs> yeah, because when I saw saw it, actually, yeah. I saw your book on Twitter, and then I, I said, like, but I know this woman. Yeah. yeah. I'm yeah. yeah. And there's some people saying we're still we're still writing one like that, and we're like, okay, it's okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and some people have said we're still writing one like that, but okay, okay, okay yeah. cool. Yeah. Add, yes. add to the knowledge. Yeah, base. exactly. Add yeah. Yes, yeah. add. Yeah. yeah. But well yeah. done. Congratulations, thank and thank you, so you for much. sitting with me. Thank no, you for thank having you. us. Yeah. yeah. Thank awesome. You. Thank yeah. you. Super. Mm.